call this meeting to order, so I appreciate everyone being here. Uh, I'd like to uh, especially thank Amy, our fine town manager, our department head, especially Chief Orman for being so persistent and working on trying to get our fire department where it needs to be Thanks, uh, after two years. Uh, but I'd really like to thank the county, the, uh, the town board members as well, and the staff who were able to attend both the work session and the uh, public hearing on the budget for the county this year because I think by showing support from the town, by the town board members for the need for the tax uh, adjustment uh, in order to furnish, probably furnish and equip our fire department was essential. And <coughs> thank goodness the county commissioners approved that uh, last week so we can go ahead and proceed with our budget because can't approve the count the town budget until we get the fire tax work out so that's been resolved now. So we'll have a little bit of an increase in fire tax this year, but that'll provide enough money to help us replenish badly needed equipment, especially fire trucks, and keep our staff going uh, as well to serve not only the town of Franklin but the fire district as well. Because most people may not realize that the fire district covers more than just the city limits. So we appreciate all that. So I'd like to go ahead and open the um, open the meeting and uh, turn it over to our town manager for uh, uh, a short summary, a quote short summary of her budget, and then the the board can take official action to approve our budget, which has to go into effect no later than July first. As always. Sure. Um, your total budget for fiscal year twenty four twenty five is eleven million nine. That's an eight percent increase from last year. Um, we added three new positions in that budget, well, two and a half, and then we just kept everything as close to being status quo as possible. Um, the tax rate is thirty-three cents per one hundred. Our district tax rate is seven cents. We have the budget ordinance in front of you. In order, to, uh, in order to go ahead and officially set the tax rate and approve the budget, uh, the board is required to pass what we call a budget ordinance and one has been prepared by the manager for the board's consideration. And I think you have a copy of it with you at uh, your seat. So are there any questions for Amy or Sarah or anyone about our budget before we proceed? I have one question. Uh, we talked a couple of times about the using the ARPA funds for the infrastructure projects mm -hmm. and that's not included that's in not the, included in the budget because that's a separate pool of money that we have to allocate when it when the time comes to use it on those projects okay that's my only question the only other thing i would mention is that uh it's been in the news lately for municipalities and counties that this year, 2024, by December 20, by December 31st, you're going to have all your ARPA money uh, committed, and we do have some of that left to, to to take care of and be committed, not necessarily expended, but committed and earmarked by the end of December this year. So we'll have to make sure we make sure we don't forget that. Uh, anything else? If not, I will entertain a motion to approve the budget ordinance for the budget for fiscal year 24-25. So moved. Thank you, Mr. Lane. We have a motion to approve the budget ordinance. Is there a second? Mr. Lewis seconds. Any discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor? Well, before, before I go ahead and talk to the motion, I need to go ahead and make a note that um, uh, Councilman uh, Collins is not here. He had to be uh, out of town for a lot of the business today, and so uh, he's that is an official excuse from the board to not be here today. We, uh, it's not, it's not uh, anything that he could avoid, so he can't be here, but everyone else is here, so. Do we need a motion to excuse him formally? Let's go ahead, just officially to officially <coughs> excuse Mr. Collins from this meeting then. Five, right, If you make a motion of that a second. Thank you, uh, Raleigh. Uh, notice any discussion, if not all those in favor, please say you do raise your hand. And Mr. Collins is officially excused from this meeting due to our uh, commitments. And we do have a motion on the floor to approve the budget ordinance for this year 
And uh, without further discussion, all those in favor of approving the budget orders, please signify by raising your hand. Any opposed by like sign? That motion carries unanimously with those uh, present. And so the budget is officially adopted and the budget ordinance is passed. And we're ready to start the new year come July 1st. Yes, sir. Uh, manager, do you have anything else for the board at this time? I would just like to say thank you to our department directors and for their staff for being very fiscally responsible and helping us to build a budget in a year that it could have gone to any number of ways. Um, and to Sarah and Allie specifically because they have to deal with all these lovely Gatsby regulations and things that none of the rest of us have any clue about. And so they have to do that all year long and then make sure everything works with the audit. Um, Nicole has to look at the various benefits as well as um, hourly rates and things like that. So that, that's not an easy thing to look at when we're trying to project these things down the road. So. We have an excellent team of department directors that work well with all of us. Um, we start our budget process in January. And so they put five to six hard months in and they know sometimes the answer is going to be no, but we are going to work as diligently as we can to make sure that we keep within uh, the parameters that you all set for us as town council. And then thank you to you all as town council for supporting us and understanding when we bring things to you that we don't take anything lightly. We aren't just spending money for the sake of spending money. It's a reasonable and realistic budget. And uh, I guess the big topic for this year's budget was uh, focused on uh, our fire district and our fire tax. And I guess I'd be remiss if I didn't allow our fire chief to say something if he would like at this time before we Proceed with the meeting. Chief Warren, you have anything you want to say to the board while you have the opportunity? I would just like to thank you all for your support. It certainly carried a lot of weight. Uh, sometimes they get tired of seeing me. And uh, to have our board of directors, so to say, come up there and support us and have our back, it really meant a lot to us for the whole department. And thank you very much. Thank you. I'd like to add that to thank the commissioners, uh, Warren Shields, and General, for their support. Yes. I had a chance to see uh, Chairman Shields at the uh, Walt for Elder Reviews uh, this past Monday and uh, expressed our appreciation for him and his leadership and the board uh, majority for passing that in uh, reference to our prior tax. So I told him the board was very appreciative of that. Is there anything else? Anything for the board members? Nothing? Is there a motion to adjourn? I have a motion to adjourn and a second. Any discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor, please say the phone or raise your hand. Any opposed to the lifestyle? This meeting is officially adjourned. Thank you all.